God morning, how you doing? This is your boy Pastor John with another moment of cheer inspiration. Listen, we're down here in Orlando, UCA Championship with Disney, dealing with this crazy mouse that wanted all my money. You know how it is. But the thing is, today I want to talk about being happy. And, you know, I've been watching the news and, you know, come to competitions and everything that's going on, people are upset and bothered or they're stressed out. And I want to say this to my cheerleaders. You're in a competition and you're stressed out. I need you not to be. I need you to calm down. I need you to realize why you got into this in the first place. Because you found joy in it. Okay? Remember, the joy of the Lord is your strength. And see, you got to understand that you got to have that same joy. That same joy that God gives you. That same happiness that brought you when you, that made you want to cheer. Parents, the same thing that brought you to do what you do in life. Why you have the children, why you do it. I know it gets expensive. I know things get crazy. I know Mickey want to just rob us blind and leave us with rabbit ears. But the thing is, we do it because it makes us happy, makes our children happy. Our coaches do it. They get underpaid. They do it because it brings joy and happiness. We got to remember why we do this thing and not get so upset and get caught, caught up in the superfluities of the ignorance of life. You know, we begin to go through things and, and, and worry and stress and begin to fight and, and, and do these things that are not like us. One of the things that I love, I was looking in Psalms 37 and 4, it said, Delight thyself also in the Lord, and he shall give you the desires of thine heart. Commit thy way unto the Lord. Trust also in him, and he shall bring it to pass. He shall bring forth righteousness as the light, and thy judgment as noonday. And this last thing, it says, Rest in the Lord, and wait patiently for him. Fret not thyself because of him who prospereth in his way, because of the man who bringeth wicked devices to pass. Cease from anger and forsake wrath. For, fret not thyself in any wise to do evil. It's just this. You know what's right and what's wrong. You know what God wants you to do. You know what brings happiness and what brings chaos. You know that, listen, you cheer because what, what are you? You're called cheer leaders. You get what I'm saying? Cheer leaders. You're here to lead people. You are, God has, pro, has proclaimed you to lead, to guide people into a cheerful state of being. And how can you do that if you're not even cheerful? Okay, get back to what makes you happy. Be the cheerleaders that you are. Because I know many of you are, and it makes, it makes us happy. You lead us in cheer. And in, in return, parents, I want you to be cheerleaders. I want you to lead your household in cheer, especially dads. Get involved. Lead your family in being cheerful. In righteousness, for God's sake, okay? This is Pastor John, Pastor of East Atlanta Church down here at UCA. You know, I got to give a big shout-out to my Rays and uh, give a shout-out. I will say we're going to give a shout-out to another team. We'll give a shout-out to the World Cup today. They're down here, even though, you know, we're going against each other. I love you. You know what I'm saying? Y'all are a great gym, great program, awesome. You know, to all my Ray teams that are here, love y'all. I know you got to go ahead and do the thing, hit it. Let's do what we always do down here, win and have fun. But first of all, have fun. All the coaches have fun. Pastor John, love you and be blessed. Let's go raise.